Hey there, welcome back to AI Code King. I am cheap, and I don't like paying for stuff. That is why I always keep looking for free alternatives to premium stuff, and I have covered them frequently on my channel. However, I could never find a really good open source, self hosted alternative to GitHub Copilot. But that changed when I found out about Continue. Continue is a full open source alternative to Copilot and is well supported by the community. Currently, it has about 105k downloads in VS Code. It works with GPT-4 API, Olama, Claude, and everything you can imagine. I'll be telling you how to use it with Olama. It provides all the options you need in a Copilot alternative. It includes an auto-completion feature, a chat window, and you can also generate code from scratch. Pretty cool. You can use it with VS Code and JetBrains currently. I'm sorry, Vim users, but it currently doesn't support your high-tech editor. Now, let's get it installed. I'll be installing it with Olama and the Code Llama model. You can use any model you want, but I prefer Code Llama because it is much more finely tuned for coding and understands coding instructions much better than other models. First, Go to the Alama website and download Alama based on your operating system. Once installed, go to the models page and choose your model. Copy the command written to install the model and paste it into your terminal. It will be installed. Once it's done, go to your VS Code extensions and install the continue extension. Once done, you'll see four models appear at the bottom of your screen. GPT-4, Claude 3, Gemini, and Mistral. These four API models are provided as a trial by Continue. You can try them out, but they are rate limited, so you can't use them on a daily basis. Anyway, click on the small Add button and choose Alama. Then choose your model. Then come back to the home screen and select your model from the bottom drop down. Once done, your chat interface will start working. Now, Let's generate an HTML form. To do this, create a new file and press Ctrl plus I. Then enter what you want to generate and hit Enter. It will start getting generated. Once generated, you can accept the changes by clicking the Accept Changes button here. Pretty cool. Let's try the same thing with a Python script to add two numbers. I enter it here and it's done. Pretty cool. You can also use it for auto-completion and whatnot. It is a really cool alternative. Let me know if you like this alternative in the comments. Also, if you liked my video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye.